What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. If you guys want some cheap MT, make sure to hit me up on Instagram and Twitter for the fastest and most reliable purchase on the internet right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. And guys, today we got end game market crash talk. Before we get into the video, smash that like button, drop the sub if you are new. It would be greatly appreciated. Let's hit 100 likes for another MT giveaway on Twitter. So make sure to follow the Twitter. 100 likes, bro. We're going to do an MT giveaway today. And yeah, man, it would be greatly appreciated. Today, we're probably going to have two to three videos. Um yeah man um we are gonna go over the market we're gonna go over what's coming and yeah pretty much just a lot of things going on we're gonna see a token market update hopefully this week if we don't i think the community might go insane but yeah hopefully a token market update hopefully this and that and this and that we gotta see something come out that's pretty cool right so token market update um some end game market crash talk and we're gonna go over a lot of things. Then we're also gonna have a locker code video off of this. So guys, please smash that like button and turn on the noti bell. Drop the sub. We're on the road to 12k. We're pretty close. But yeah, guys, let's go over it, man. We are gonna talk about a couple things in this video. Here it is, man. This is all I really want to talk about is the market, the market, the market, the market. And yeah, guys, the market is going to die like crazy. You are going to see the market crash like crazy. But here's some tips and MT tricks I'm gonna show you, okay? So let's get into it. So first off, guys, if I were you, sell every single card you have in the whole entire game. But I'm going to tell you how to make MT off your cards the most best way. So first off, I know a lot of you guys have cards that aren't buyouts, okay? If they're buyouts, you could just throw them up on the auction. It's fine. But if you have cards like Tracy McGrady Leap Year, Tracy McGrady Gr Glitched, um Giannis uh Opal Giannis whatever you got guys cards that are above a buyout how to make MT off them the easiest way okay I've done it literally this whole week it's so easy so this is what you do you buy high tier cards when you see them at the cheapest so for instance I'm gonna try to get this Giannis for around a mil 1.1 mil right at nighttime bro I would say around 10 o'clock 11 o'clock 12 o'clock eastern you want to throw up your best player that you cop for a mil or 500k or 300k or 400k. You put them up for 12 hours at the nighttime. I don't know why, but every single time I sold a car, it sold for ridiculously more MT. So that is one tip for you guys. You are going to make thousands of MT off of it. Whether you have Lamella, whether you have Giannis, whether you have point guard KD, whether you have Rashad Lewis. If you put them up for 12 hours at nighttime at 10, 11, 12 a.m., you are going to make the most MT off that card. I don't understand why, but believe me when I say this, you will make the most MT that way. So if you're going to sell your team today, if you sell your team today, you're 110%, 110 million trillion percent going to make MT, whether they drop content tomorrow or the next day. It is 110% guaranteed. So that's one thing I want to say. Get rid of your team. YBC said, don't get rid of your high uh don't get rid of your, any card dude get rid of any card you're not gonna see a day of light like for instance guys i told you guys sell your team so long ago if you guys remember when eddie curry's going for around eighty thousand mt about a month ago he's now thirteen thousand mt guys i sold mine yesterday for thirteen thousand. he's probably around like 17 he's literally around sixteen thousand mt so if i were you guys make sure to sell your eddie curry's it is a hundred and ten percent a good idea that is number one number two sell everything bro pink diamonds opals diamonds amethyst you want as much mt as possible for this end game market crash it only goes down from here guys today is july 15th you are going to see everything drop in price guys you're going to see a constant drop in price in everything so if i were you sell everything you have make your mt and now we're going to go into some tips Alrighty, so for some tips, here we go. We got a lot of little talking to do. There's a lot, okay? There's a lot of tips we should be doing right now. Um, first off, guys, I go over this filter too much, man. It's the Galaxy Oval. It's the cheapest filter in the game. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, 
like I said, enabled. I got Larry Hughes. I got all of them. Now Cedric Sabolas is going to free up the filter. But yo, if you guys want to make, like I said, if you're going to sell your whole team and you want to make millions of MT, I'm going to give you this method, okay? Let's say at Endgame, if you've been playing since Endgame, you should have at least a $3 million team. At least. It's Endgame, guys. This game has been out for around 300 days. If you've been playing my team since day one, sell your whole team, get your 3 mil MT together, buy every single buyable Opal on Friday, and snipe. It's simple. You will make a million MT minimum a day, okay? Whatever pops up, you're going to see every single Galaxy Opal snipe before everybody in the whole entire world. So what I recommend, buying this Sabolas, buying this Francis, buying George Gervin, buying Walt Fraser, buying Sarunas. Okay, it might cost around 3 mil MT, but think about it in the end. You're going to make 3 mil MT alone off that one filter. You're going to have every Galaxy Opal in the game that's viable. You're going to get every single Galaxy Opal for the low. So that's my number one method in the game, buying every single viable Opal on a market crash day, which is Friday, if you don't have the MT to do so. There's a lot of ways you can get MT. Pink Diamond Filter, man. Money, money filter. Opal sniping, pink diamond sniping. Like I said, guys, on Friday is the day you want to have the most MT, okay? The most MT is the day. Like, when you have the most MT, guys, what you want to do is simply, simply, whatever you have. Let's say you have 500,000 MT. To make quick MT, you're going to see on this pink diamond filter, and you're going to snipe all day. You're going to snipe so many cards for the low, bro. Whether it's Wiseman, whether it's this card, whether it's that card. You want to pay attention to bid sniping. It usually happens on a market crash. That's why I always say sell your cars before Friday. Friday and market crash happens. So what I've been doing the whole entire year, I buy my team on Friday. I sell it Sunday, whatever, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I buy it back Friday, get way better players for cheaper. And it happens every week in and out, in and out. And that is the best empty making method in the game. And now... Since the market crash is coming, like I said, man, it's going to get down and down and down from here. You're probably going to see Opal LeBron around 200,000 MT within the next couple weeks. Yes, it sounds crazy. He already went down about 400,000 MT in about one to two weeks. So why do I say sell, bro? Like I said, man, best time to sell any day. You can sell any day as long as 12 hours put up for 12 hours. 10 11 12 eastern i don't know why it's the best method it sells for more every single time i did it with Giannis. i did it with lamella ball i've done it with tracy mcgrady i've done it with tracy mcgrady leap year and glitched i've done it with lebron james i had this card fully evo he sold for 1.1 mil as you guys can see he's going for around 635k evo probably 800k so yeah like i'm saying guys i have videos and all that that's how you're gonna make the most mt when you're selling your cards, when you're buying your cards. There's also other filters, man. There's the LeBron Opal filter. There's the Thunder Galaxy Opal filter, which is one of the best filters in the game right now. You just need to buy out Sean Kep and Gary Payton and your home set free. Home Sean Kep and Gary Payton. They're very cheap cards too. Not only that, they do have an insane dynamic duo with each other. So if you're going to spend 80,000 MT between the both of them, go ahead, man. It's a very good deal. These cards are very, very solid. Also, man, um, Prime Series, guys. Prime Series 3 Small Forward. A very, very good one, guys. There's Lamar Odom. There's LeBron James. There's Paul George. There is... Um, who's the other one? I forgot the other one. And Kawhi Leonard. So, yeah, this filter is going to be solid. You're going to make lots of MT this way. I really, really hope you guys just try this method out. There's so many methods in the game. Don't get me wrong. There's certain enable filters. Don't get me wrong, but, yo... Yeah. If you want to make MT the fastest, you could try out this filter. You could try out the pink diamond filter. You could really just sell your cards and buy your team back. It's so easy. That's really the best way to make MT. You literally just sell your cards, buy your, buy your team back. Every single week, you're going to make a lot of MT. If you sell the way I do, 10, 11 to 12 at night, and you buy your cards back on Friday, you buy, it's simple. You're going to make MT every single week in and out, every single week. Try it out, man. Let me know how it goes. That's really all I got for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for more content. We're probably going to have a locker code video out before this. This is pre-recorded right before it so, or after it. So hope you guys did enjoy. Stay tuned. Have a good one, guys. Peace.